okay? One is actually a group uh, interaction strategy for me to kind of track your discussion within your group, okay? Um, I'm going to give each group one of these sheets. The group is going to have a facilitator. Now, the facilitator has to participate in the conversation, but the facilitator has the extra job of tracking everybody else. So what you're going to do when you get this piece of paper, the facilitator is going to write names in the block, I mean in the circles for each person, okay? When the conversation gets started, the facilitator is going to start where, wherever that person's circle is. And it's going to start there. The next person that says something in response to the conversation or participates in the conversation, draw a line to wherever that person is, no matter where it is. All right. Then the next person that contributes to the conversation, draw a line to that person. And then the next person, even if it goes back to the first person or the line goes back, okay, you're going to connect, you're going to draw lines to kind of connect the interaction of the conversation, okay? Does everybody kind of understand that? All right. Can the lines go back to a person? Yes. Okay, go back and forth, yes. Um, within the class, what do we want our group interaction to look like? Okay, a bunch of lines back and forth. We want everybody to contribute, don't we? All right. So can I look at this or can you look at this at the end of the class and evaluate how well you contribute to the group? Yes. Mm -hmm. yes, you can, and we will do that. You're going to actually look and reflect on this at the end of class and decide if you need to kind of step it up in your group, if you need to uh, interact with your group anymore, if you need to add to the discussion more. Um, could it also tell us if one person dominates the group a little bit too much? Yes, it can. And we need a balance, don't we? Yes. Yes, we do. We want to look for a balance. All right. So for right now, I want you to decide who is going to be the most responsible person in each group to be the facilitator. Whoa. What are you Whoa. doing here? All right, secondary. Yeah. Way yeah, I'm, look, I'm not listening. Ways. What are you saying? Hey, I've met with Southern Squares College. I know, but primary waves are first oh, in the sorry, round. Sorry, I was reading S waves. Chill out. Is everybody getting their resources back? Great job. Thank God I asked. Secondary waves are dark. Secondary waves are second. All right, now next, I got the, I got the diverging one. These waves are secondary waves. I meant surface waves. Yeah, surface waves are last. Get it together right. a little bit. Yes. All right, divergent. We already have this, but uh, it. This is whenever divergent plates move away from each other and create new crust. All right, now what I want you to do is look at your interaction graph. And as a group, I want you to discuss how the interaction graph went. Were there, uh, did everybody get equally, inter equally interacted? Were there some that dominated more? Were there some that did not participate as much? And, and I want you to write your group reflection on the back of the paper. Write your reflection on the back of the paper.